Just to show you how to change the core on one of our sort of basic sabers. Uh, a couple of things, quite a few of them are different. As you can see from these two switch sections, one has screw holes either side um, and only one at the back. <clears throat> this one here doesn't have any screws either side but has two at the back. So I'll just show you the difference in the setups in these. Um, also the hilt, hilt wise, some hilts like this are beta one unscrew so you can see quite a lot of the chassis like that other ones might only unscrew from the pommel but it's the same system it just means you've got to push it further down so i'll just show you exactly what i mean um this one for instance if you take a look at this red one this will have two small screws either side so you remove those screws if it's like this one both of them have this screw at the back so you can take that out <coughs> And this switch system has a long, large grub screw. Uh, and if you have the other switch system, that doesn't have a long, large grub screw. That just has the two either side of the switch. Once you've got all the screws out, so that's either these two or these two, what you may have to do is just push the button downward just to remove it from this centerpiece if it hasn't dropped down itself. Once you push the button down, you remove your core. That is as simple as that. Then when you get your new core, slide it back in, obviously line that up. The best screw to put in first is this small wood style type screw, because that just keeps it in line. If you've got this switch section, turn it over, put your two screws in and that'll bring the switch upwards. Just make sure that the switch do it slowly so the switch is in line. You might have to shuffle it about just to pull it through. If you've got this one, all you do is get it started in there. Once you've got it going, turn it round. Just make sure that that button section is aligned, which mine isn't. So I'm just gonna move it slightly. just to make sure it is accurate and going in the right place. And you keep screwing until the button becomes nice and flush with the sides. And that is that. Screw your grip section and pommel back on. As I say, sometimes some of the sabers, the saber you might have this section might be complete one section, and in which case you would just take that off. Take that off, unscrew, same again, and then either slide it out that way, or depending which way, you still might be able to slide it out the bottom. But that is the system as a whole. Any problems, please come back to us.